Hello fellow educators. Today's activity is called Rational Exploration, Numbers and Their Opposites Vocabulary Builder, where I provide the kids a horizontal number line and a vertical number line, not only on their worksheet, but I also have it taped to the classroom floor so kids can get up and interact with this particular number line. And how to use the number line was to model these words through a series of questions, and at the end, they had to develop their own definition using their own words. And then we went back and compared it with the actual definition to see how close their definition is to the actual definition. So we start off with our absolute value, in which I encourage you all, use these number lines to introduce absolute value. It's so much better for the kids conceptually. For them to get up here and actually take five hops to positive five, and also take five hops to negative five, seeing that I don't care which direction we went, we took a positive number of hops. And that leads into discussions of why absolute value is always positive, because it's the distance the number is from zero. And if you want to take this step further, you can start subtracting with this on this model. If you want to take this step further, if like five minus negative five is 10, you can model it on this. But that's a little later in the school year. Now getting back to this activity, so as I define absolute value in their own words, we went to negative numbers, and I asked them, what do you notice about all the numbers to the left of zero or below zero? What do you notice? Do you notice any type of sign in front of those numbers? So take what we just discussed and develop your own definition for negative numbers. And kids saw, well, the further left we go, the smaller the numbers are. They know that once you start getting to the left of zero or below zero, it's like a minus sign that's running the number, which is a negative sign. So once again, this was a really good activity because kids got to develop the words, the vocab words using their own words. It wasn't me telling them explicitly. It was them discovering and seeing for themselves.